Hello everyone, in this short video we will discuss enzyme as a therapeutic agents as well as diagnostic agent. This particular question is repeatedly asked as a short note in theory exam as well as it is asked in a viva. So let's start. So first we will see enzymes as a therapeutic agents. So there are many enzymes which are useful as a drug for the treatment of many diseases and the examples are First one is a streptokinase or urokinase which are useful as a thrombolytic agent for the treatment of myocardial infarction. Streptokinase is isolated from streptococcus bacilli and it helps in a lysis of blood clots. It activates plasminogen which gets converted to the plasmin and it helps in a lysis of fibrin clots. Another example is asperginase. Asperginase is useful as an anti-cancer agent for the treatment of acute lymphoblastic leukemia. Third example is pepin which is used as an anti-inflammatory agent and the last one is alpha-1 antitrypsin which is useful for the treatment of emphysema. So these are the example of enzymes as a therapeutic agent. Now we will see enzymes as a diagnostic agent. So there are many enzymes which are useful for the estimation of many important biochemical substances as well as they are useful for various techniques. So the first example is glucose oxidase peroxidase and hexokinase. These two are useful for the estimation of glucose. Then urease which is useful for the estimation of urea. Uricase which is useful for the estimation of uric acid. Cholesterol oxidase it is useful for the estimation of cholesterol. Lipase it is useful for the estimation of triacylglycerol. Alkaline phosphatase and horse redis peroxidase it is useful for the ELISA technique. Last but not the least Restriction endonuclease, it is useful for the bloating technique and reverse transcriptase enzyme, it is useful for the polymerase chain reaction. So that is all about enzyme as a therapeutic as well as diagnostic agent. Thank you.